Hey, welcome back to Gen X Grown Up. I'm John. I am a Gen X Grown Up. Thanks for checking out this video and the channel. Joining me today is MC Murr, longtime friend of the show. Uh, we did a collaboration over on MC Murr's channel where I was introducing him for the first time to Archon. Murr, thanks for being here. What did you think of Archon? I was just really impressed at the depth that you've got here. We've got character classes. It's straight out of D&D. &D, and, you know, at a glance, I could see, maybe I did see it back in the day and didn't know. And I think we've talked about this in passing, that at a glance, this may not have been one you went home with. You're like, oh, no. Yeah. You know, puzzle game, I don't want it. Uh, it's so much more than that. And it's far exceeded my expectations. So in part two of this video, Murr and I are going to play Archon competitively for the first time. He's learned how to play. He's practiced a little bit. He knows all the rules. If you didn't see the video over on MC Murr's channel, I'll put a card up in the corner. You can click on that. And you should click on that if you're not familiar with Archon. And you should give MC Murr a subscribe. A great YouTube content creator. Uh, a man after my own heart. Fellow Gen Xer. Latter end of Gen X. So he definitely is well within his element here on Gen X Grown Up. Let's take a look then at Archon. First thing I want to do is I want to reboot the Atari and show you uh, what the opening title screen looked like because oh, I love the music in this. So it's intense, it, and the only time it plays is here in the opening. Nice. See, that's got the uh, authors there on the, flat, the splash screen. Uh, who does that anymore? You don't see who the programmers are on stuff. Electronic Arts, that little EOA logo at the bottom, 1983. But we're going to play a two-player, and I'm not going to take home field advantage. I'm going to let Murr go first as the dark. Oh. So he's the blue over on the, the uh, right-hand side. I'm the light-hand side, yellow over on the left. And uh, we're going to get into Archon right now. It is on. It is on. So the entire board is white right now, which makes it really tough for you. You've got to kind of dodge, duck, dip, dive, and dodge a little bit. Uh-oh. Dark Force coming forward. So as a refresher, three ways to win in this game. One, kill everybody which is pretty much the same as true of every game you've ever played. <laughs> Number two is claim those five power points that are around the board. Oh, the basilisk is stuck. Yeah. But just the fact that there is a basilisk is great. <laughs> Bonus points for having a basilisk at all. I'm coming at you with my basilisk. You know I ain't having this. Me and John <laughs> playing the Archon. I'm the evil and I'm getting my dark on. Spitting some rhymes in the middle of Archon. Oh. It's when people start stepping out and claiming those power points that the game gets on. The Banshee, the Banshee Whale dancing on a living heart. We'll see if anybody gets that reference, but they won't. <laughs> they might. Manticore. Manticore's oh. moving up. He's, he's running up the gut. He's stepping out to the power point. Eye formation coming at you. So not only can you win by being on the power points, but if your characters are uh, injured, being on the power points will slowly heal them over time. So that's an extra okay. bonus. That is a bonus. Up until now, someone would be forgiven for thinking that this is a chess game, but you just uh, flipped the script and show that it is not a chess game. As it soon as an not. attack takes place, we go into this arena. Oh, and because you're oh, a shapeshifter, okay. yeah. you became a phoenix. Yep. Ah! <laughs> Cancelled each other out there, it seemed yep. like. Yep. Your timing is impeccable, sir. Oh, you got me. My timing is impeccable. Oh. Like Iron Mike Tyson and his punch out. And I'll be eating my lunch out. <laughs> oh, we can't have that. We can't. All right. We got we to we we return the favor here. Maybe you can't. You you were very happy with it, I'm sure. It's totally fine. Well, I, I was expecting to get stomped here, and I still might. Oh, your siren. <laughs> oh, the banshee whale. That's what that was, right? Yeah. He was yeah, screaming. Got it. So this is a, you know, this is where the strategies mix and match. Ooh, ow, ow, you got me hit against that rock again. Run! Wow. She's powerful. Yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 ow! Oh, good gracious. And we're in the light. Murr, you got some, uh, some natural Archon cred here. Good gracious. Well, who'd have thunk it? Now, there's no range on this. I can... Nope, wherever you want. It is done. It is done. All right. We're going to move in. I'm going to try. Since you're in the light, we're going to buy Golem against your Manticore. Okay. That'll be a good match. Well, for you, based on recent history. 
oh. having manticore issues early on here. That dinging is very important. That's how you know yeah. your weapon. Ooh, has recharged. Ooh, ooh, you uh. just you just got golemed in the A. Yeah. Wow. Hung up on the rock, man. It'll get mm. you. So we're three to two. You have three power points to my two right now. I do not. I do not approve. I don't care for that. I'm guessing you will do something about it. I'm, I'm going to endeavor to. Although it's yeah. getting dark right now, so I don't know how long I'm going to park on that one. I think I'll bring him up, get him, because it's just turned pitch black. Oh, man, it is. Like the heart of these evil beings. The freaks come out at night. Your banshee's a freak. Mm. Trolling it up. Trolling position. <laughs> I don't think your manticore ever healed. Healed. I'm going to give it a shot over here. It's kind of dark. Oh, I'm hurt. Oh, I'm hurt. Yeah, he's a fresh manticore. You killed the other one. Oh, well, why didn't you, as you know, a friend told me. To <laughs> I'm the dark side, though. That's true. Oh, yes. I'm just, I'm just playing Ooh. a character. Ooh. Well, I died anyway. God, yeah. what a horrible mistake that was. I'm sitting here trying to make jokes about <laughs> D and D alignment instead of. <laughs> you done, I just took care of your fresh manticore. Ah, see, that was a strategy too. Well, it's it's not over. So my strategy is I just get him Seymour riffing about something else so he's not paying attention. That works out great. Did you see that goal, that ice golem on page 25 of the book to me? <laughs> I did. Oh, you I got it. Oh. So sorry. All right. You know what? I think it's golem troll time. Oh, ouch. Oh, I took one to the head. Yep. Ouch. Oh, ouch. my goodness. Oh. Attack. Retreat. Hold your ground. Oh, he's going in for the kill. Ooh. 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 Ow, 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 ow. You're, you're faster than me, and I can't get away. Look, look. I'm trying to kill you. I'm doing it. I'm well aware of your intentions. Oh, oh. Oh, wow. He's way too fast. That hurt. Time for a scrub fight. Your shapeshifter. Ooh. Oh. Ah. Oh, come on now. Come on now. Swashbuckling on the Spanish main. So I got four to one now. You just have your sorceress's power point. And she is a force to be reckoned with. So it's not like, oh, we'll just go kill her. It's she's she's on the dark space and she's the sorceress. Oh, who are we bringing back? It's a tough call because they all do really cool things. That variety is a neat mm. part of this game. It really is. You're talking about character classes with unique abilities, and that balances in with what the terrain does to you and right. the matchups against the other character classes. You know, it's nuts. It just the the combinations, the formulas, it sends the mind reeling. I gotta say, I'm a fan of the Banshee. He's fast. He's super fast. And I hope that thing is the troll's other arm that's sticking out there and not what I'm thinking. I, I'm going to say it is. Yeah, it's his right arm. <laughs> but I think we're going to go... Basilisk. With the Basilisk. Mm -mm. Got it. The rocks did not continue to play in my favor there. You can feel <laughs> the physics when you hit the too. I mean... The, They're like the, a bounce back, isn't there? Yeah. And again, yeah. you know... I could see somebody in 2019 not being wowed by that in a game. You would expect it. In this, that's really a large hint of detail there. You and I have played enough games from the late 70s, early 80s to know that that was not par for the course. No, no, no. And they had to think that far ahead. I yep. could see this whole game concept to finish being done and not even thinking, hey, let's make this club rebound off the run. Nope. Dragon is fast and powerful, deadly, and it's getting dark. All things I don't know. Kind of like the lyrics to a heavy metal song. Fast and deadly, getting dark. The dragon's powerful. <laughs> Scaly son of a bitch, getting hit by an <laughs> archer's bolt. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Aha! Right your scaly butt. Ow! Oh, never mind. Woo! and weaving. Yeah, it would have taken me about seven more hits on you. <laughs> I think. I walked right into it. Right, what an idiot. right up your nose. With the rubber hose. Mini Barbarino. Welcome back on it. 
Ooh, wow. I'll tell you, Murr, for a new Archon player, you are holding your own. I feel like I'm very much in the game, right? Like it's not that it's anyone's game, but that I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm doing something. And I think that's a testament to it's it's so approachable. The 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 entry vector for this game yeah. is very 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 flat. It's not hard to get into. I'll second that this feels approachable. It's like I'm not expecting to win, but it doesn't feel like I necessarily just won't. Yeah, you're not just getting clobbered uh, because I played. Yeah, it. yeah. Because every little matchup is another game. No, whoa, oh, whoa, he oh. went too far. This has been an issue with all of the Atari flashback classics and all that stuff on modern day console. It was meant for a joystick. Thumbsticks are these wild, uh, wobbly. You got all this travel. And it yeah. does lead to that a lot of times. There's games like Crystal Castles and That's stuff like point. that. Because that, every move can send this into a trajectory. The other way, and that's the important. That's another important aspect of that balance. There's always this. It's this, a constant ebb and flow that makes it just feel like you're never underwater. Did you imprison somebody? No, I opted to shift time. Oh, as I need the dark to work in my favor. Reversing it back. I'm gonna go for the sorceress just because. You're going for the kill. I gotta take a shot. Uh. Ooh, ow! Okay, I chipped away at her. You did. Oh! All right. Well, I heard her some. What I lead is like three pieces lined up, one after the other, to come after you. She will have healed a little bit, right? Yep. Just from mm -hmm. one round on the That's on right. the demon function. Absolutely. Yep. Ooh! Oh! One away. Ooh. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! That is. That's tough. We're, we're going to go to the booth on that one. And... <laughs> yeah. That, it, you still have your dragon, so it's not like it's game, but you lost your, your ability to cast spells. Have, yep. Your shot must have been just that much early. So my task at this point is to stave you off while I get your dragon killed, because that's the one impediment between me and victory and your dragon right now. God. Oh, oh God. that didn't hit? Woo! Oh! That was some, harsh. That was harsh. We got some. We got some hitbox issues here. That's There's not like. Let's look at the power the dragon has on the side there. I, I don't even shot. Look at that. Boom. One hit. Oh. <laughs> I, I knew it was gonna be a tough. Let's see if you're gonna do what I would do. In that spot, I think I would have gone and tried to uh, kill the guy who was on the dark power point. Easier kill. Oh, that would have been smarter. But you know me, and it's ever my weakness in almost any game genre. Which, you know, sometimes works out. Yeah. Ooh! That was oh, a nail. Oh, right in the corner. I, I, I fear that this could be just a matter of time. Uh, all right, so we got a couple spots to take. It's not, uh, it's far from over. Gold versus Troll. Ooh, ow, right in the top. Oh, damn. Oh, he's too slow to dodge. He is. Once the, once the shot's coming, it's coming. I love the sound of them lumbering around. You know? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's the details, because, it, again, is. we talk about how limited programs were, I mean, on the hardware. All right, I'm going to go for the win. I'm coming in. When yeah. you see them do that much with it, it's like... It's, it's awe-inspiring. It's for all the marbles. Oh. You, you have a vulnerability in that top corner you walk into. Oh! Yeah. Uh, I didn't uh, give you my best on that one, that's for sure. Uh, well, The game has ended. Well, if, if, there's a, if there's a bright side to it, no pun intended, the light side wins. <laughs> So happiness and goodness will reign once more in the land of Archon. I, so I'm really happy to have been able to like introduce you to this. I'm surprised you missed it, but it's not it's not like totally outside of the realm of possibility. As you said, you started playing a little after the release. It looks like a chess game at the top level. Uh, but uh, So now you've had a tutorial, you've played it. So overall, a pretty positive opinion of this game? Absolutely. And as a collector, I would say that instantly want all the versions of this at my disposal <laughs> box complete with all the stuff uh -oh. right here 
in the collection, and we'll work on that over time. There could be uh, potential videos. I don't even have that. I would love to get a Pirates Archon. You know. Yeah, they're beautiful. They're the, that cardboard, that heavy, looks like a like a record album, you know, that came from yeah. EOA at the time. MC Murr, I can't thank you enough uh, for playing Archon with me. I'm happy that you Pleasure enjoyed it. Pleasure was it. all mine. Yeah, absolutely fantastic game. Again, if you did not see the video where Murr and I ran him through the uh, nuts and bolts of Archon to understand all the pieces, I'll put a link to that down below and in the end card. Uh, until then, I really appreciate you watching. Hope you found something to enjoy this video, and I'll talk to you next time. <laughs> Bye-bye. Gen X Grown Up is dedicated to bringing you new Generation X-inspired videos every week. Here are a couple more you can watch right now, but for even more, subscribe and enable those notifications. And if you love what we do, we invite you to support us over on Patreon. And of course, your feedback in the comments and a quick thumbs up are always appreciated.